How's it going everybody, Ben from Budget Pokemon here, and in this video I'm going to be having another pack battle. This time around the new Shiny Treasure EX versus last year's High Class set with the V-Star Universe. It's gonna be amazing. I've done a lot of these on the channel, so what I might do is I might make a playlist and put it like up in the corner right there, or in the description below. But without further ado, let's just start out with cutting this one open and cutting the V-Star Universe open. Man, it has been a long time since I've opened V-Star Universe, since I basically have all the cards I ever won from V-Star Universe. But for the sake of this battle, we're gonna be ripping over, or ripping open one more box and get this, get this show on the road. Man, this is gonna be amazing. So many cool pulls. Of course, I still need a bunch from from Shiny Treasure EX, but we'll see who will come out ahead. Cast your votes now, which set you think is going to win. I mean, it all really depends on what the what the super rare is for each one. That really that really depends on what this is on, on who's going to win. So let me just get the the packs out to not clutter the table. You know, we can have a nice a nice setup. There we go. Here we go, Shiny Treasure EX versus V-Star Universe. Let's start ripping open. Cast your votes now who's going to win. I'm gonna take a guess. I'm gonna say V-Star Universe is going to win. That's my guess. We'll see if we're right by the end of this video. Let's open the first one right here. Let's see if we pull the, the Shiny Super Rare in our first pack as well, just like the, the last opening. Let's see, Toxicity, we've got a Dodrio. Or a Dodu- No, it's a Dodrio, okay. Good Xian Pao. And... Nope, nothing in this one. A nice Akira Igawa illustration. Hang on, I do need to set away... Or set aside these ones. Because we're gonna calculate the full arts for, for each one. Not any bulk or anything, just the, the full arts. And then, of course, the super rares. Once we do pull them out, so I ripped that open the wrong way. But that's fine. That is fine, I can remedy that, trust me. There you go, see? See, I could remedy it. No need to worry, calm down, calm down. Calm down, we've got an Absol Rare, we've got a Meltank, we've got a... Well, I've forgotten, okay. We do get three Art Rares from V-Star Universe, so that's a plus. And Charizard V-Star, that's a nice one. Got a mirror, we've got a lost vacuum, and we've got a spirit tomb at the end there. Okay, two pulls right off the bat. This is why I think that V-Star Universe might win, because I think in general you're gonna get more pulls and maybe even better pulls, if you if you will. But as I've said, it all depends on what the super rare is for for each set. We've got a pine co. And I guess the, the baby shinies also matter on this one. Professor Turo, very nice. We've got, here we go, we've got our first baby shiny with a Pelipper. We also get this one, very, very nice. And I think that's it for this pack right here, yep. That is it for this pack, I might have to rearrange some stuff here. Okay, there we go, let's keep on going. Let's keep on going with the opening. And see what we can find. Also, if we pull a god pack on, on either side, that's probably going to decide it. Um, once again, I've never pulled a god pack from any of these. Here we have our Radiant card, which is also promised in, in V-Star Universe. You get one Radiant card per box. Also get an Anamorus here. Nice. An Anamorus and the Regilecki at the end there. Whoa, this... Yeah, I think just the sheer amount of pulls it's gonna, it's gonna let um, V-Star Universe win in the end. Okay, I've rearranged it a bit again. This time we have a bit more, bit more space. If I can rip this open. This one was very hard to rip open. So that means there must be something, something great inside. Watch, watch me pull another Pikachu. Watch me pull another Pikachu baby shiny, that'd be something. That would be insane. We've got Pro Boss's Orders featuring Spaghetti's. Our reverse. And a Paldean Whoopie. No, Paldean Quacksire. Let's put you right here. I've got Clavel. 
And that's it. No super rare in sight for either one of these. Um, I'm actually I'm actually curious to see if we get an illustration rare this time around. Because I always thought they were promised, but there's only like four illustration rares in the whole set, and we didn't get one the last time. Maybe the trainer, the full art trainer, replaced the illustration here, which I'm happy with, by the way. Always do like full art trainers. Here's our second art rare with the Thievel. Very nice. And here is our special art rare with the Deoxys VMAX getting beamed up or beamed down by Orbeetle. The planets in the background. This is very, very nice. Okay. So here we have our special pull for V-Star Universe. Um, not to say that we can't get another, an additional super rare. Because there are certain boxes that give you an additional super rare. In form maybe of a full art trainer. But we'll see. So that is our, our special art rare pull for V-Star Universe. Let's see what we can get in this one. There are so many cool cards in, in Shiny Treasure EX. Not only the shiny ones, but of course, the full art trainers and the Charizard, the Guard of War, the special art rares or illustration rares. Here's another baby shiny. That is that is very fitting. I feel like this is one of the best ones in terms of, of looks. This is very, very cute. We've got a Skeledurch EX. Kilowattro, I think this one is. And there we go. Alright, let's move on. Right now, I'm pretty sure that V-Star Universe is in the lead. And we'll see if that will change. Let's see. I mean, if we do pull a full art trainer, I think this will just, will just catapult it ahead. Here's our last art rare, a mill tank, one of my personal favorites from V-Star Universe. Here is the Illumineon V, and oh my god! Holy moly, Elisa Sparkle! It was a box with two super rares. And not only that, I'm pretty sure this is the best full art trainer you can pull from V-Star Universe. I don't know if this is better than the Irida that you can pull from, from V-Star Universe, but I, I'm pretty sure this is one of the best full art trainers you can pull from V-Star Universe. Okay. Well, that just catapulted V-Star Universe ahead by a huge amount. The only way for Shiny Treasure EX to get back from this is to either pull a God Pack or to pull a really, really high value special art rare. Holy moly. Okay, this is actually super, super cool. Hang on, I'm actually going to sleeve this up because I think this is going on the pile with, with cards I need to, to send in for grading at some point. Collecting another pile. Yo, okay. That is that is amazing. That is amazing. That's the only card I didn't buy from V-Star Universe back when I was grading a lot of V-Star Universe cards. Because I already have the Elasis Sparkle from Fusion Arts. But oh man, okay. Well, well, that is cool. That is very cool. Alright. Alright, let's see if Shiny Treasure EX can come back from this. Right now, V-Star Universe has a huge lead. Has a huge lead over Shiny Treasure EX. Nope. Still not the super rare. At least this time around, it's not in the first pack. So we still... We're still being... We're still being let on. Um, okay, let's continue on with the, with the pack battle. Man, I love doing these. I've done so many of them. So, as I've said in the beginning, I... I will probably create a playlist and then just link that in the info card on the top right corner and in the description below. So check out some of the other pack battles I've done in the past. I've also done one um, from or v with V Star Universe before. This is like actually the second pack battle. I think I've done um, V Star Universe versus Crown Zenith, kind of like the English the English equivalent versus the Japanese equivalent. I actually don't know, I don't remember who won. Might have been V-Star Universe, actually. So far, it looks like V-Star Universe is gonna take the crown again. V-Star Universe is gonna take the crown again. Unless, unless we pull something crazy. Unless we pull something crazy. Well, still just a, just a double rare. Still no super rare in sight. Still no super rare in sight for Shiny Treasure EX. You know, the last box it was in the first pack. What, sh what should be in the last pack now? What should be in the last pack? 
man, oh man, okay. Let's see what else we can get from V-Star Universe. I'm pretty sure the only things we are going to get right now... Oh, okay, no, I was wrong. We still get a, um, get an energy, a fire energy. Holy moly, just think about how stacked this box was. Seriously? We've got a, we've got a super rare energy. We've got the, the special super rare trainer, which isn't promised, by the way. Usually for V-Star Universe, most of the time you're just going to get these two. A special art rare. Let me just show off the other cards. There we go. The, the camera can focus. Usually you would only get like the the super rare energy and then your special art rare. And in some cases, certain boxes, not all of them, can contain an additional super rare in form of, most of the time, a full art trainer. So this one did. And that's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. Let's see, I mean, we still got a few chances here. Or Shiny Treasure EX, I should say, still has a few chances to claw back the victory from the grasps of V-Star Universe. It all depends on that super rare. There's our double rare, our texture double rare. That showed up. What should just be a box that doesn't have a super rare, which wouldn't really make sense. Since I've actually bought all three of these booster boxes, you know, the, the, um, the, whatchamacallit, the Shiny, Shiny Treasure EX box that I opened last week. Um, and this one I'm opening right now, and the V-Star Universe. I bought them all from the exact same seller, so I don't think any of these have been messed with. Of course, this one hasn't been messed with, and so hasn't the, the last one, the one I opened last week. But if it doesn't have a, doesn't have a super rare, that'd be something. Okay, I mean, the pulls just keep coming in for V-Star Universe, yet it's, it's low-value cards, if you will, but those add up. Those add up. If you have enough of them, if you have enough of them, they will add up. Okay. Let's see. What's, what's our super rare going to be? Is it going to be a shiny Pokemon? Is it going be going to be a special art rare? Which are incredibly difficult to pull. So I've heard from Shiny Treasure EX. It, it, oh my god, is that the Elder Ghost? Super sh or sh um, shiny super rare. Okay, well, there it is. There it is. Okay, we still have the chance, although I'm not sure, maybe to pull a full art trainer. I mean, I've pulled the Clive from my first opening, so that th it still goes. I don't think there's any full art trainer that can make up for it, though. Not even the... Actually, I don't know if the... No, the Iono doesn't have a normal super rare. I think Nomona does. But then Nomona's is also only about 20 euros or 25. So I think... I think V-Star Universe might have this one. But Cynthia here, very nice. And we've got Gardenia. Gardenia's Vigor. already have that in a full art. Also, actually in a pre... Uh, CGC Pristine 10. Very nice. Okay, let's see if we do get an Illustration Rare, or if we get a Full Art Trainer. I would hope for a Full Art Trainer, because that would mean I wouldn't have to buy them for when I want to send them in for grading. Let's see. As there's the Yono. Unfortunately, the wrong Yono. We have a Double Rare with the Noivern. Okay. Also, we're still missing one Baby Shiny. We're missing one Baby Shiny. And then maybe an Illustration Rare or a Full Art Trainer. So that last pack should, well, it should at the very least contain a Baby Shiny. Maybe a Full Art Trainer, maybe a Illustration Rare, but we'll see. Um, so I'm actually going to do it like this. We're going to open the last V-Star Universe pack because I want to uh, finish it off with the last Shiny Treasure EX pack. Here we have the Zashian V. Friends in Sinnoh. Very cool card. I do love the, the friends card, and now that the that the Chinese gift box finally gave us access, or access for a for a reasonable amount to the friends in Alola, I'm super happy. I'm super happy. I'm probably gonna open more Chinese packs in the future because there are so many other gift boxes that I've mentioned in that video. There's like a special Marnie one where you can get the full art from um, from Shiny Star V. 
you can get that one um, in a promo box. And then there's also the one, also one for Charizard where you can get the Rainbow Charizard VMAX. Also as a promo. Okay. I'm probably gonna open these and maybe like one more, um, one more exclusive gift box for the friends in Gala or friends in Alola. But here we go. The last pack for Shiny Treasure EX. This should definitely contain our last baby shiny, which could be a Pikachu. If it's a Pikachu and then a very, very good full art trainer, I think Shiny Treasure EX could still claw this back. But I guess we'll just have to see. Guess we will just have to see. We've got a Mankey here. We've got an Armourage, I think. We've got a Stormy. We've got... Okay, no, it's just a freaking gosh darn stinking dolphin. Okay. Let's see if there is an illustration rare or a trainer or just nothing of the two in here. Let's see. It's a double rare Miraidon. Okay. So, no illustration rare, no full art trainer. Interesting. Okay. So, last time I got really lucky then. Last time I got incredibly lucky. Um, This is just all promised, of course. So that was an that's that was an odd box, if you will. Okay, well, so here we are with the ports on each side. I mean, I don't think I even have to look it up, but I'm pretty sure that V Star Universe won, um, mainly just because of of the Elisa Sparkle. But I think even without it, um, it probably still would have won. I don't know if the Deoxys is more than the Eldegoss, but right here are the values for these two piles, and this comes as no surprise that this one won. Or, wow, what a shocker! This one actually won! You know, I have to cover both fronts here. Well, but I guess that does it for this video. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy it, then give it a thumbs down. Tell me in the comments below what you didn't like, so I can try to fix that for future videos. Right here is a video that YouTube thinks is best suited for you. Right here is the subscribe button. Click this one first, then click this one. Check out any of the other videos mentioned in the description below. And other than that, thank you so much for watching. Peace, peace.